Hey guys, welcome to this cleaning video. So we are going to deep clean my kitchen. Let me show you the situation. So this is the situation in this kitchen. We haven't had water in like today is Saturday. We haven't had water since Tuesday. So I've just finished watching this because this is what we'll use for cooking and stuff just in case water disappears again. So I first want to soak some of these clothes and then get started on this kitchen. So on this kitchen, there are so many things I want to do. Look at the situation of the plates. I'm telling you, if you don't have water at, in the house, it's a mess. So you want to clear all these and then I'm going to clean this since I got this cooker because I got it when there was no water. Now I want to clean it because I already showed you the situation. Look at all this. You see, it's not that clean. I need to clean it. So these, I'll also do this. I also need to clean the floor. It's not clean. I just don't like this situation. Whose house is this? <laughs> Let's get this cleaning started. Let me soak those clothes, then start with the utensils. You pull me through I give it up to you I do it all for you Maybe this feeling's overdue You're uninvited You wanna hold me close But I'm the one you have to Yeah, 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 yeah Why are you hiding? Tell me what must I do Come to you, come to you You're mine, mine, mine It's right, right, right It's right I decided to first wash the dish rack and this whole sink area before cleaning the plates because I wanted them to be in a clean place and I was so happy to have running water on this particular day. I also want to take this opportunity to welcome all the new subscribers. We've had a lot of new subscribers. I know some of you have followed me over from TikTok. I appreciate it so much and i also thank my loyal subscribers who've been riding with me from the get-go thank you so so much so my name is linda mary and on this channel we do self-development videos and we also do lifestyle vlogs so we have a lot of cooking we have a, uh, we have a lot of girl talks we have a lot of like just lifestyle vlogs showing you how i live my life and we also have some money talks you no know? So welcome and if you've not liked this video please just like it as we continue it will help YouTube to push it to more people and also check to see if you've subscribed if you haven't please subscribe as we continue. So now that dishes are done, I'm moving over to my tubana. I just want to clean it. I still have this tubana at this point. So, <laughs> yes, we have to clean it. And it's not dirty per se. So I'm just using a wet piece of cloth to just wipe the surfaces. Had a feeling we had something. Could have seen it in your eyes. Took a second, but I'm right here waiting for you. Maybe we can try Meeting up by seven You'll be safe 
I like wiping this part of the wall because when you're cooking, food sometimes splashes onto the wall. It is now time to clean my forbana and <laughs> guys don't laugh at me. I just need some guidance over here. I don't know how this thing is cleaned. These are plants. This is my first time owning it. So I decided to just clean this part with a, a wet piece of cloth. So I want to clean this part where the banners are and I'm just using my normal uh, dish soap and then I'm just wetting the sponge and then just removing those surface um, dirt and then I'll just go in again <laughs> with steel wool to just scrub these food particles, not these stains because I really don't know how this part is supposed to be cleaned for real. So guys, those who own for banners, how do you clean this part? Are there special like cleaning detergents um, uh, things that you use? Let me know so I can buy them, so I can use them. But for today, this is what I'm using because this is what I think will work. <laughs> I'm just scrubbing it with a piece of steel. And funny thing is that the stains are coming off. So I'm happy with that for now. now. We took many years ago When I said to you We would never grow old Messages I've saved That I never sent Cause I don't know you But I used to back then I remember that I was drunk I'm then Going over with a wet piece of cloth Again so that I'm Cause I, I'm trying to avoid putting water Into the banners <laughs> to clean these <laughs> but again i don't know how they're supposed to be clean and see they're dirty so i'm just going to use tilul for this one and the other one. those two i'm just going to use tilul the way i've been doing with the ones on the banner and then yeah and the stains are actually coming off that is what shocked me It's now time to clean the inside of this oven or grill. <laughs> and I'm telling you, it had gathered a lot of dust. You see, the, the top part had blown off. So, you know, uh, the person who gave it to me stopped using it at that point because uh, that part had blown off. So, you see, it had accumulated dust. First of all, we wanted to remove that. I'm so grateful I have this. Is it for that chicken? It's called what? What, what something chicken? <laughs> So I was just taking all of these out so I could clean them, wash them, and then also wipe the inside. But you see, 
when I looked inside, I saw these particles. And given that I was told that that part had blown off, the outside part, I assumed this was glass. And I was like, you know what? I know you're not supposed to use like a broom inside, but I'm not touching glass with my bare hands. So I decided to just sweep it out <laughs> for safety purposes. And then when it came out, I started looking at it because it didn't look like glass. And then on touching it, I realized it was just paper. <laughs> So I'll just continue uh, by wiping the insides of just wipe and then clean that piece of cloth and come back and wipe again. Even now you're coming up to me, fire lighting up the sky. Feel the ground shaking underneath, trying to take me alive. So I didn't know this part was too sharp and when I was cleaning it, I just cut my finger. Ugh. It was a little bit painful, but I just cleaned it and we had to continue. So I was just doing it very carefully. <laughs> I was a little bit scared, but I was like, we have to continue with this cleaning and do this today. I found a picture we took many years ago. When I said to you, we would never grow. So guys, I know I want to clean this part of the cook and I have a question. You see this paper, the way it's peeling off. Can I just peel all of it off so everywhere can be grey? Is it grey? That's stainless steel. 
Can I just peel it off so that it can look like this other part? Or what do I need to do? Do I need to go and uh, have it, have them put another paper over it so it can like look a little bit brand new? <laughs> I'm waiting to hear from you. Let me know like what to do because I want it to look like you no, know, a little bit newer. So I was just scrubbing this part. <laughs> yeah. You used to call me sweetheart. It was different when we first met. Fast car with your hand on my headrest. Wow, your voice was my favorite sound. Oh, but now you say you miss me. Haven't seen you in a while since you did. You remember those clothes that I had soaked? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I used the time to tackle them. <laughs> So I was just fetching some water and then I just want to wash these clothes. And guys, I want to remind you, if you've not liked the video up to this point, please do. Because when you do that, YouTube translates it to mean that this video is valuable and then it pushes it out to more people. Again, to my new subscribers, I'm Linda Mary. I have one daughter. I am a mom. <laughs> I am a writer by profession. I'm now a YouTuber. I'm just a girl from Kenya, Nairobi, who likes to have fun and who is trying to be the best version of herself. And that is the hope that I have that I'm building this community of people who want to be the best version of themselves, who want to work on themselves and enjoy this life to the fullest. you pull me through i give it up to you i do it all for you maybe this feeling's overdue guys so when you're washing uh, your clothes at what point do you switch them like from inside out i normally do this when i'm rinsing so that when I'm, I'm done i just go and hang them do you do them when you're rinsing or do you do them when you are hanging them one by one right I had not mentioned it, but I started this cleaning at 4 p.m. So by the time I was done, it was 8 p.m. <laughs> you know, that's the time that we had water. So that's when I started. It was dark except for that light. We normally have a, this light. So it helps to illuminate. And you see here, my daughter is here. I don't even think you can see her. She's just in the dark riding this bicycle. <laughs> there is this bicycle. They, she'll ride with, their bestie, with her bestie. And it's a little bit spoiled. It doesn't have wheels. So she just gets on it and pretends like she's riding. So <laughs> I decided to just um, hang the clothes and I'm happy that I, did, I washed at this time because at least there was space. In the morning, there was no space because water came. Um, most people had water in the morning. Everyone uh, scrambled to wash and hang the clothes. So it came when they had at least unhanged them. It's now time to clean this floor and I've, after sweeping and doing all that, it was even more dirty than before. <laughs> so I'm just going to mop it and then we'll have a clean, clean kitchen. But I first decided to sweep so I can remove all these particles and then go over it with the mop now. Had a feeling we had something Could have seen it in your eyes Took a second but I'm right here Waiting for you with open arms. How about you coming closer? We can do my place. 
The only one who likes dipping their uh, legs in water when I feel like my legs have maybe some kind of dirt, I dip them in the water before I continue so that I don't transfer those the sand <laughs> onto the surface. <laughs> Tell me what you want to know. Run your fingers down me slow. Cause you're in my head. You are, you are. Cause you're in my head. Cause you're in my So I'm done with the cleaning, but let's recap on how this house first looked from the clothes <laughs> to the plates like this place was dirty to the, the floor the cooker like it was just a mess look at how dirty everything was and now look at the final result this is how clean this house is i'm telling you i am so Happy with the results. Look at the cooker. I couldn't even believe it. Like it was so clean. The stains came off. Everything was just clean. Look at this side. Look at this side. Remember how dirty it was. And my aim was to just make it cleaner. Not even sparkly. I just wanted it to be a little bit cleaner. But it came out way than, uh, better than I expected. This even the tubana was clean. Even the plates. I'm telling the utensils was just sparkling. I just love a clean, clean house. So this is the final result, guys. By this time, I was so tired. I just wanted to bite something and then sleep. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you've not liked it, please like it. And I hope you also watch my other videos. See you in my next vlog. Bye-bye. <laughs>